Hello, everybody, and welcome, or welcome back to more Brotato, the arena survival action roguelike itself. We are going to be checking out the newly unlocked farmer here. 30 to harvesting. Harvesting increases by an additional 5% at the end of a wave. Minus 50% materials dropped. All damage modifications are reduced by 50%. So we obviously want to go for, like, lots of harvesting, but then pivot into damage of some kind. So I really don't think that hand is the angle for it. It just doesn't scale that well with it, but I will take hand because I think that maybe going for the best thing would probably be going for spiked shield, but we kind of just already did that. I think I would rather go for taser since it's kind of, you know, it's not something I played around with too much. Uh, so we'll give it a shot. New enemies appear. Inflation is higher. Enemies are stronger. Drop less materials and two bosses appear at once. Great, 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 great. But yeah. These This first wave here, 33 materials, nice. We're not really going to be able to kill much. Like, I'm aware of that. It's going to be pretty, pretty lucky if I really get, like, much of anything. Okay, we got a little bit of materials there. Look at that, 68. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad. Let's take the harvesting early. But here's what I kind of want to do. Well, first of all, I'll lock that. I want... That's so tempting. I want Taser. Okay. You can't roll again. I know we rolled past some really good stuff there. Like, don't, don't get me wrong. I know we did. But I need to make it clear. Rolling like crazy to get your weapons before Wave 3 is pretty strong right now. You are guaranteed to get two weapons in the shop before wave three. Like if we could have started with the taser, I wouldn't have gone for it that way. But since this character can't start with the taser, I had to do some, some shenanigans. Um, but like, I probably shouldn't have rolled past fertilizer. Either way, I think we'll be okay. Uh, out of this, I say no. Speed, I suppose. Harvesting. Taser. Keep those locked. We want to keep on rolling so that we can get absolute taser to the extreme. Like, we will buy those weapons after the next shop when we're not guaranteed double weapons, you know? But right there, we were guaranteed... You're guaranteed two weapons in the shop, and you are much, much more likely to find weapons of your type. So therefore, we are going to tunnel vision on getting as many tasers as we can for right now, since... They don't do a ton of damage, but they scale really well, I think, right? Didn't we find that they um, they multiply? You get, like, times two or something? But we want as much harvesting as we can right now. Uh, sure. Bip, 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 bip. We'll do that. Not guaranteed to. Okay, we get both of those. We got our six, so it means we got uh, 25 harvesting from that, which is going to scale like crazy. We already have 90. That's the thing, is it's... it's Every one was a guaranteed five harvesting. Wait, why does my character look like that? Oh, that's like... That's the B? That's what you get when you... Get the B, interesting. But we're actually doing a pretty surprisingly good amount of damage. What's our penalty for this character? 25% on damage gains? This is not bad. This is not that bad right now, all things considered. I do want to get to the trees, but I don't know if we're going to really be able to kill them in time. One. Yeah, whatever. 133 bucks. This is nuts. Attack speed is nice. I'll go with luck. It's early. Harvesting. Sure. Don't get me wrong, like, spiky shield would be great. It'd be absolutely awesome. But... Okay, don't really want lost stuck. I don't want to get elemental damage down. Eight times two. Does this really... Does this really do two times the amount of damage on upgrade? That may be the strongest upgrade from common to rare that there is. 
What the hell? I was expecting some kind of downside. I thought I remembered that was the case, but that seems that seems so strong. Oops, why did I dodge that way? That was disgusting. Actually disgusting. Okay, well, those these spawns were so dumb. Oh my god. That spawn, that one that like crossed me up there, that was just truly gross. I can't. I cannot take blood donation. Dear God, do I wish I could. I, I just can't. I would die. Will I lock it? Maybe. Hmm. What would we need? We would need so much HP regen. I just can't. One damage per second when I have 21 health to begin with right now is just... It is going to kill me. And I'm not going to leave it locked in my shop until it's valuable, because then, like, the exciting thing about getting it early so it can exponentially scale up is is irrelevant. Like, we just... We don't have lifesteal. We don't have HP regen. Our luck game is not very, very high. Um, we are honestly not that strong, so we're not even going to be killing very many people to get lots of, uh, you know, drops from luck to begin with. Oh, this is not a good pathway through there. I wouldn't mind Lumberjack shirt. We'll take, we'll take, we'll take. No. Yes. Yes. Crit chance damage down. Uh... Yes. And you know what? Yes. Ugly tooth. We, we dig it. We take it. Damage modification reduced by 25%. Okay. 156 harvesting. Don't mind if I do. How are we doing for damage? Like... Considering we're in, we have three elemental damage, assuming from literally just having six tasers, we're doing all right. Oh my, really? You can just make it really, really far. We need to get some uh, some elemental damage ups ASA pronto stat. Thank you for the crates. Look at them all clumped up in the middle there. Looking like ding-dongs. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Yes. 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 Okay. Eight up to eleven. That should be that should be pretty noticeable uh, as far as increases go. It sort of looks like um, I can't tell if our times two bullets can hit the same unit twice, or if they have to spread to a different target. That's something I can't tell. Unaware. Run, run, run. Slow, slow, slow. Just get the hell out of the way. Get the hell out of the way. Get the hell out of the way. Oh, God. Screw you. Screw you with that spawn. I'm so glad that we don't really need to kill that much. Because we are not killing that much. We're kind of like doing a, uh, a pacifist light kind of angle. Meaning that we uh, we can get kills. Like a 12% damage. Why would I say no to that? Yes, yes, roll. I mean, flamethrower is something. Trees dying to hit is good. That's good. Uh, I will lock this. Damage modifications are reduced, meaning metal plate is two armor, and it may not be the full damage downgrade, so. Oh, oh, this wave is great for us. Oh, it's beautiful. 
Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. Trees dying one hit. We have double trees spawn. Right. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. What are we looking for mostly? Do we want... I mean, we need damage. We need survivability. These spawns are a bit gnarly. I want those trees. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. I saw the HP. It was worth it. Oh, there's so much money I can't really get to. Uh, don't get a lot. Uh, max HP, HP regen, minus luck. I will take that. I will take two armor right now. Why does wings have to be freaking... Uh, it could be worth it, though. It could be. It's, we don't get that full damage downgrade. I'm going to say no. Just my mic there. Um. Fine. Oh, that did go down by 2%. Well, it's a 25% penalty, I guess. So it wouldn't have changed that much, but extra luck sounds nice. 214 harvesting is very good. It's very, very good. Oh, weird dodge. Weird dodge. Yeah, we definitely, we have to dodge like a little bit, a little bit different today. Because of the fact that we're going for that like kind of ugly tooth slow down situation instead. Don't move as fast as I would like. A little bit of speed would go a long... Ooh, uh, long way today. Thank God for that extra HP armor stuff that we were going for there. Ow! Thank God for crates healing now. Please? Please? Ow! Sure. 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 I don't care about engineering. I don't have anything, right? Because otherwise I could buy that to get a free reroll. Bowler's hat. That's a lot of stats. Oh my god. Oh! That's like a full buy it shop. We're not going to be able to, but that's all very, very expensive. Okay, we're kind of okay against these guys just from the amount of slowdown that we should get to apply. We're not great, though. Because we're not, we're not killing. We're not killing here when we really kind of need to. They're going to catch me, aren't they? No, maybe not. Maybe not with the slowdown of both elements. It's not that I'm doing enough damage to, to stop them from getting me. It's just that the slowdown is really effective. I can't get those trees. Okay. That guy's going to catch me, isn't he? No! This is so uncomfortable. Get the trees. Thank you. Just want to tunnel in through the trees. More damage, please. Uh. <laughs> it's like I, I want to start getting my uh, my piggy bank action. Is what I was gonna say. That was useless. That was that was a bad idea. We could have had two epics right now instead. I don't know why I thought that we would we had like basically any amount left over if we did it that way. I don't know why. Lots of luck should be uh, a good amount of HP drops. The thing is, we're not going to be killing that much. We're not very good at killing. It's not impossible for us to kill. 
We're just not very good at it. Okay. Ow. He managed to get to me, I guess. because <sighs> Very good dodges. Stop touching the mouse. Yeah, baby, baby. Hey, baby. Hey, yo. He moves. Fine. Uh, at this point, I will take armor. I will take that. Combine. Go for it. Go. Another taser. Sure. Cyclops, what's my range? I have no range. I have no range. Hmm. One flamethrower is actually going to be huge. It just attacks so fast. It does that one damage so, 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 so fast that it's still pretty good even with, like, no help. You know? That's kind of the thing about it. And they will be clumped up like a son of a gun, so they will get flamethrowered like a son of a gun. I do like all of these trees that we get to go for. I mean, that was just trying to make big circles around here. Oh, boy. But it's not working great. Oh, boy. There's some good dodges here, though. I can't deny. Not to toot my own horn too much here. There's some good dodges here. All right, I'm liking this. This is very weird, but I'm liking it. Uh, yeah, sure. I have negative 11 crit chance. It's too much to, um, sure. This should be enough to be excited about, I guess. I guess another boulder hat. Weird, but okay. Elemental damage, sure. More speed could be good. What's my luck at? I guess, I think Cyberball is just good now. It's weird. All right. I think one flamethrower goes a long way because, yeah, 16 times 5 burning damage. Still nothing to scoff at. So we're just going to slow everybody the hell down and clump them up while we burn them to death. So that should be pretty good. Lifesteal suddenly became uh, appealing. The sad news is I think we have pretty bad lifesteal. Okay. I think we'll just, uh, I think we just want one good flamethrower, right? I do hate all of these bullets for us here. It's not something we're going to necessarily excel at dealing with as this character. We slow down enemies very well, but that does not slow down the bullets. Can't help but notice that does not slow down the bullets. That was a lot of regen. I was just hoping that it was going to be enough. I thought I died. 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 I'm going to take the legendary regen. Uh, I thought I died. Barely a penalty. Okay. Don't kill those. Well. Try not to kill those. We do not do great against the bullets, so I don't want the hosts dead. They're going to they're going to die. Like I'm not gonna be able to stop them from dying. Okay, if we get some kind of like burn propagation, that'd be beautiful. Just look what one flamethrower can do though. Like it went from us um just being able to control the group in order to like actually kill them pretty darn quick. So much money just kind of hanging out there, but I don't see any health on the ground for me to pick up. So I can't do the Giga Chad maneuver, unfortunately. There's, like, in order to do it and not be stupid, there needs to be some HP there, right? Like, uh, it's a little late for harvesting to 
legendary. I'll take the final. I'll take the harvesting. Who cares? Uh, glass cannon with a 25% penalty on that. Minus three armor when I don't get full effectiveness from it. Uh, bite me. 5% life seals. What do we do? We take that, though. We take that. We take it next time, but we take that. Right? We don't get the full two uh, elemental damage penalty. That's just so much dodge. It's hard to pass up. Oops. Sorry about that. How are we looking? Pretty darn good. Like, this has become weirdly effective for, you know, the, considering the fact that we don't have, honestly, like, that much damage output. We kind of do. You know? Considering... Our damage stats are bad. Our damage output is impressive. Lots of HP sitting around. That's kind of why I'm looking to go for this. What is going to be our angle on the boss? Like, it can't be kill. Like, our angle, like, there's no way. I don't even think that our slow... Wow. I don't think our slow does anything. I think getting to positive life steal could actually be really, really nice. I will take Cyberball. Uh, I will definitely take Leather Vest. I will lock that. Uh, burning Spreads is going to be really, really nice. Okay. Oh, I hate the buffed up fools. So we got the cape, yeah? Dude. I hate the buffed up fools. They are just going to kill us. God, it's what an annoying situation that is, you know? It's like, I will chase you down until the end of time. There's nothing you can do about it. You will take the damage. God. We, like, we're slowing them down and everything. It just doesn't even really matter. Look at all the buffed up sons of guns that are chasing me down there. Ow. Not like I was gonna, I was gonna freak out. I was gonna freak out. Take the extra armor there. Even more armor. Sure, screw it. I want to take penalty to life suit. Uh, it's a little bit. It's a little weird, I suppose. How much more? We don't need more harvesting. Harvesting has become stupid. HP region. We got one every 0.79. We have six percent life steal, which is really good with the flamethrower. That being said, do I trust this wave? No, it's not my favorite. Like, we may just... We may be okay. But it's not my favorite for this build here. Ow. Let me see that. Let me see that regen. Let me see that regen. Let me see that lifesteal. We also have, like, a, a non-zero amount of dodge, too. Like, we're, we're doing pretty well there. Thirty-one dodge. Yeah, we've got survivability out the wazoo everywhere. We, we have, like, not the highest amount of, like, actual HP HP, but... Like, just more raw HP would go a long way for us right now. Okay, what is this? Wave 18. Interesting. Interesting. We're getting so much money. It's absurd. I'll definitely take that dodge. Uh, I don't think I have any knockback. I have no knockback, so I don't care. I will definitely do that. I will combine to get another taser, because that just seems like a great call. I ah, sure. 5% less enemies? Sure. Most of our uh, money does not come from having more enemies. More enemies means more lifesteal, of course, but like, eh. I don't think it's the angle we're going. 
I would like more burn propagation. I think that that would be really, really handy. If I could find uh, a legendary or an epic, another epic flamethrower to get a legendary. It really is something that is totally acceptable to just have one of with this situation. Uh oh. Thank you, dodges. Okay, okay. Just like, we want one really good burn, because burn does not stack, you know? Burn does not stack, so having one really good source of burn that applies to just like everybody all the time is just really good. Look at that. Look at that. I'm gonna go for HP. Just, like, we just wanna live. We just wanna live. I just unplugged my headphones. Uh, bonus dodge will standing still. Kinda puts us at the dodge cap, but also... How relevant is that? Uh, how much am I gonna be standing still? More life steal goes a long way for us. If only. Uh, it's a mixed bag. I'm kind of upset with these options that I'm getting offered here. Hmm. Hmm. As far as I'm aware, this does work on Taser. It's just kind of weird. It, like, slightly works. Fine. It's, it's kind of like a weird gimmicky way of working, but, like, I, I don't know how to fully explain it. Like, it... Our projectiles like, sort of explode on contact, but they still exist in... They exist for like a mere moment or so. Anyways, so you can kind of like in pierce with an invisible bullet, sort of, is how I would say it. It's just, I don't... Oh my god, that was janky. It's just kind of strange. But it, just trust me when if it, when I say if it's like the demo, Taser does technically get piercing. It's just a very short-range pierce that is not as strong as piercing on other things. But having anything that uh, can pierce and do slowdown is just going to be really good anyways. Okay. God, I love our survivability. It's so good. We pivoted so hard into survivability, and it's beautiful. Okay, this sucks. How many dodgy boys do you need? How many dodgy boys do you need on the map at a single time, huh? Okay. Stupid. Please stop. We pretty much have every source of survivability you could possibly want. This was, um, probably one of the easiest final waves we've had in a very strange way. What the hell? Look at this item! Plus four melee damage, plus two range damage, plus ten harvesting? This is such a good item. This is incredible. Minus two elemental damage, so, like... I, here's the thing, though. I love, love items that have minus two melee damage, or minus two range damage, or minus two elemental damage as the penalty. Because guess what? A third of the time, that's irrelevant. Or a fourth of the time now, kind of. You know, like with... Uh, engineering. It depends on which stat, because obviously, I feel like elemental and engineering get used a little bit less than other stuff, but um, yeah, more or less. I just, this just works so well. Like, all of these tasers did such a good job clumping enemies up, keeping them away, keeping them at bay. Flamethrower, one single flamethrower, even with the, like, having a 25% damage growth penalty, flamethrower is still going to be good, doing two damage at a rapid pace. Two damage every 0.14 seconds is still really good. And it has 14% lifesteal on a rapid fire weapon. And 22 burning damage every uh, or six times is still an extreme amount of damage. You know? That is still a large amount of damage. Like, whatever, like 134 damage or something. That's still really good.
considering that we have 13 elemental damage, 24% damage up. Not that bad. It's not that bad. And uh, since Bernie doesn't stack on each other anyways, it's just having one flamethrower is, is still really good. Six flamethrowers is good if you want to abuse the two damage aspect, like the rapid fire aspect of it. Um, one flamethrower is better if you're just trying to abuse the uh, burn element. But uh, yeah, very cool. What a good item unlock, though. This is such a such a good item unlock. Four melee damage, two range damage, ten harvesting. That's going to be usable on so many characters. I'm going to take that so many times. I guarantee you that. Like, that's an amazing find. All right, well... That is that. That's going to do it here for today. I don't know what I'm going to do as far as, like, I'll probably, you know, we'll be checking out some of the older characters yet. But I think I may shortly revisit some of these other ones as well. Like, I'd expect that pretty soon. Like, we're making our way through the roster uh, pretty darn well. Like, the, the new changes on the beta and alpha branch have made it so it's like, I don't know, danger level 5 is, it is challenging. Like, I need to make it clear. Yes, I'm winning a lot. <laughs> yes, I am winning a lot. But let me make something clear. I have how many hours across? Uh, I have forty. I probably have. I probably have like a hundred hours of Brotato played, kind of at this at this point. When you combine the demo and early access, I probably played about a hundred hours. I think it's fine if someone with a hundred hours in a game that is largely about the item drafting uh, can win very often. I think that that's okay. I, I really, really do. Because I, I still think it is, it's giving me a challenge. I've almost, I almost died like four times that run. Like, I I, uh, I succeeded on like four coin flips that run. I really could have died. I could have lost. Uh, but I think it's totally fine for it to be the way it is right now. Um, and they can always, you know, you can always add other difficulty levels later if you really want. And on top of the fact that, um, there is the accessibility settings here. Like, yes, you can lower them. I have them all on default at 100, but, like, yes, you can lower them if you want to make it easier. But you can also increase that enemy health to 200%. If you're feeling like a ding-dong and you just want to go nuts, you can go 200, 200, 200, or, well, 200, 200, 150. If you want to do that, you can. Am I interested in that? No, I'm not. I really like to play games at the intended difficulty and uh, and work from there. Change materials sounds. What the heck? Uh, but alas, less. That's that. If you'd be sad to see the series go, you gotta let me know in the form of a comment down below. Thank you for watching. Check out the channel for Roguelikes and more every single day. And I will see you next time. Bye.